It's me, your little boy, okay, Samson. You know, this video is going to shock many choosing ones. Listen, I always advise us, put in your best what effort in all you do. Be the reason why your enemies are depressed. Yes, this may sound crazy, but let it be. You know, when I wake up this morning, I look at myself. I say, Lord, bless me to the point where I will become the reason why my enemies are having sleepless night. <laughs> Bless me to the point where those who never expect me to do well in life end up always become sad. Bless me to the point where those who thought I will fail, where those who thought nothing good will ever come from me, we always end up become so sad. This is not a sin. But let it be that you are the cause why some people who walked away from you, who treated you bad, who never counted you out, are always stalking you. Don't be the reason why they are celebrating. Yes, never you grow to the point where because someone treated you bad, someone looked down on you, someone, maybe they chased you away from your working place. That is the reason why you allow them to do or to be celebrating. Be the reason why they are always going to be angry. By putting in the best of you. By working. If it takes you to put 100% of your effort in your life, my brother, do it. Trust me, God will be so proud of you. you. Don't come to the point where you become the reason why they are jubilating. Don't let it come to the point where you become the reason why they are filled with joy. Don't let it come to the point where you become the reason why your enemies have the courage to do evil. Not only to you, but to the outsiders, to people within you. Be the reason why they quit in doing evil. By showing them what God is doing, by putting in your effort, whether it's little or little, not little, focus on that your little because the little beginning may be what small, but the latter end will do what will accurately expand. So be the reason why some people cannot sleep. <laughs> that, that whenever they look at you, they, they'll be like, how do you do it? <laughs> how, how do you make it? How, how do you able, go back? How do you able to exist without us? How do you able to manage without us? How do you able to cope without us? How come you are able to do all these things without us? Be that person that caused the pain in them. Be the reason why they, they will suffer. Be the reason why they will keep suffering. Be the reason why many people around you will hate their own life because they don't want you to essay. I'm not saying it's, it's something so adorable, no. But there are people who are waiting to celebrate because of the fact that you quit. There are people who are ready to celebrate because they treated you bad, they can't take you out. And now nothing is working out for them. You give the room to them. You give the occupation to them. You give your life to them by what by by not being able to do or to hold on your stand. You know, I I I, I was talking on TikTok yesterday when I saw a man, a soldier, that her her wife, the marriage of twenty years, the, the her wife decided to go and sleep with what with her own with his own brother, and he figured it out the moment he come back from war. The man was so brutally, was so annoyed. I look at it, I say, if I'm able to have this man contact, ah, I will make sure he smile. So don't let what you are going through become the reason why some people will celebrate. It does not matter how many times you fail. It does not matter who betrayed you. It does not matter who, who did you shake or who did you bad. It does not matter the kind of, you know, uh, 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 treatment that people have treated you. Let it be that that which they did to you become the fuel that you take seriously to do or to bring out the best in you. I can remember all that they told me. Eh, you can't be able to do nothing without me. But not that I'm proud with where I am, but I'm proud that God proved them wrong. Not that I'm content with where I am, but I'm content because God decided to prove them wrong. Because they, they are watching. Trust me, many people are watching me. Many. Because they never believe that I will be able to be who I am today. That is why I'm telling you, be the reason why they are sad. It may sound bad, but just be the reason why your enemy will always be sad. Be the reason why they are depressed. It does not matter what it takes you. Put in the best of you. 
Be that reason why some people cannot sleep well at night. Be that reason why some people cannot eat and feel comfortable. Be that reason why some people, be the reason why some people will do it. We always have what headache every day. Be the reason why some people will always be what be annoyed with the life God has given to them. By doing the best, by proving them wrong. By not allowing them to celebrate. Don't be the reason why some people will say yes, it is it is good. It is it is what it is another system of our life. Don't be the reason why some people we said, Where is your God? Be that reason when some people make the mistake to ask you, Where is your God? That when they look around you, they will feel so sad and depressed. That when they look around you, they will feel so embarrassed. That when they look around the glory of God that is shining and multiplying within you, they will do what they will become so what frustrated. So be that reason why some people will always be angry. Remember, blessed.